This is Susan Sun Anamaker with Sun is Future on Net here at Rochester, New York, the starting point of American Solar Challenge 2012. We have here Jordan, who's the team captain of University of Michigan's team, the Quantum, isn't it? Yes. It's and uh, well, well, I will be interested in finding out what Jordan has uh, learned from this whole experience. Oh. Well, uh, you know, you learn a whole bunch of things. So when I first joined the team, I obviously I have my area of specialty. Um, I actually deal a lot with weather and atmospheric science. Um, but the biggest, one of the coolest things is that you get to integrate with all the other disciplines and all the other, you know, engineering mm -hmm. um, aspects of the car, mechanical, electrical, all that good stuff. So you get to learn a lot more than just, you know, what you actually set out to, uh, to accomplish when you first joined the team. Okay. And is there anything unexpected that occurred that you need extra time for? Um, no, I think we uh, we ran real well. We just came back from the Formula Sun Grand Prix. We came first there. Um, so we're Congratulations. Just, thank you. I'm um, just preparing the car right now, charging and getting ready for the American Solar Challenge. Fantastic. Hopefully for the remaining seven days, it'll be bright and sunny throughout the whole race. Yep, yeah, hopefully. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, if not, we'll just have to figure out what strategy we do and find out what, what's the right speed to drive. Well, your school is very experienced, right? How many years of um, uh, the race have you... It's about 20 years, um, so we, yeah, and uh, a lot of that's carried over, so we've learned a lot of things and uh, been able to carry that on to each um, subsequent car. What percentage do you think your team members are new? Um, actually, so there's 19 people on a race crew and only three of them are... Um, past race crew members so everyone else is oh, so it's new very team. new it's yeah. a very new experience for mm -hmm. most uh, just almost all mm -hmm. yes that's correct fantastic and uh, do you think most of the members are actually from college of engineering or it's so, all over sorry I didn't mean to interrupt you we're actually all over um, yeah we do have a lot of mechanical engineers electrical engineers um, but we do also have a business division and a media crew. Mm -hmm. So uh, yeah, we're just all across the uh, entire university. Very good. That's a great learning experience for everyone. But what about, uh, there's a slight rule change this year. Is it down to uh, six square meter for the solar cells? Or? Yeah, that's correct. So um, in the past, it used to be nine square meters of silicon and six of gallium arsenide. And this year, it's uh, actually six of silicon and it would have been three of gallium. So, or actually, we're only allowed silicon. So um, that's that's uh, what we had to run this year. Last year we were allowed gallium. Were you able to get a lot of uh, industry help or donation? Um, yeah, so uh, most of our sponsors are on there. Obviously, yeah, it's on the truck. If you want to get a shot of that too, it'd be good. Obviously, being in Michigan, uh, we're able to work with the big three. They're big sponsors of the team, um, and then Roush as well, and, and all the other sponsors listed on the trailer. Um, so that covers, you know, um, in-kind donations as well, and they do everything to basically support the team and actually get us here. Very good. I hope you guys also have a lot of fun with it, too. Yeah. All right, great. Thank, Thank you, you very much, Jordan. Signing off, Susan Sun, Nanamaker with sunisafuture.net, uh, July 13, 2012.